Finally, a golf story. If anyone has a great story about keeping the passport updated, it has to be golfer Harold Wallace. Harold is a professional golfer, originally from Greenup, Kentucky, now lives in McDermott, Ohio. On Friday, he's off to Wales. 53-year-old qualified for the Senior Open Championship, which will be held at Royal Porth Call in Wales. Earlier this afternoon, he was practicing at Belfont Country Club. Harold's coming off a closing round 63 at Firestone, which turned out to be a course record. And with that, he claimed a spot in the Senior Open. He's played in three PGA Tour events, but he told Jimmy Tracy this afternoon, this is a special treat because open courses are so unique. You get in those little pot bunkers, you just got to hit her sideways or hit it backwards or something, you know, so it's going to be just, you know, just stay focused and try to just keep it, keep it in front of me. And I'm sure it's going to be windy and it's supposed to be windy and rainy and every day over there is a chance. I mean, it's something I'm not familiar with, of course, because I've never been out of the country, but <laughs> looking forward to get over and get to play a few practice rounds on it and getting kind of excited. All right, so to wrap up I'd that say. passport story, the reason he has a passport but hasn't been out of the country is another golfer, Bob May, who almost mm -hmm. beat Tiger Woods in the PGA title years yeah, ago, yeah. told him that uh, not to, he was going to go over. He got a passport to go play golf, but Bob May said, oh, you'll just spend a lot of money. It's not going to do anything for you. <laughs> so he has the passport. <laughs> now great. he gets to use it to go play golf. Wow. That's going to be incredible. That's a great that's story. Yeah. Yeah. Heck of a golfer. 63 at Firestone is an incredible wow. score. I'd wow. say so. Yeah, yeah. Something he's earned he won't it. Forget. Yeah, yep. Good for him. Hey, thanks, Keith. Hey, Harold, put the shorts away and bring the Gore-Tex when you play over in the British Isles, right? Uh, we've got some severe storms that are trying to form in central interior southern Ohio right now. The lead cell is now crossed out of the Big Bend of Mason and Meigs and now is into northern Jackson County. Ravenswood, Ripley, here shortly, Ripley, here comes a good rush of wind, rain, maybe even some hail and some lightning strikes. And over toward the fairgrounds in Wellston, I'm concerned about these storms that are forming in Jackson up toward Ross counties and Vinton County. These have the markers of some heavy weather will keep you posted on the opportunity for some severe weather. Most of us are waiting for the sun to go down, guys, which means there's some good outdoor activity hours to be had here. But oh, off good. to the north, the kids are inside as these storms are on the prowl. Yeah, that's smart. Better safe than sorry. Yes, yeah, something to keep an eye on. Thanks for joining us this evening. Why is this man so happy? He's got advantage checking from Community Trust Bank. CTB's got him covered with credit monitoring and identity theft protection, cellular phone replacement and repair, roadside assistance service, and travel and leisure discounts. And with his Advantage Plus interest checking, he'll never pay a CTB ATM fee no matter where he uses it. So be happy. Get Advantage checking from Community Trust Bank. They said I have to take tests when they tell me to. They said my degree would cost a fortune, but I didn't have to listen to them because I have a university that listens to me. Tests on your time. Courses on your time. Graduate on your time. WGU, the University of U. Camps.